What up, folks? Welcome back to Ultra Zilla Toys, and today I have a review of the 1000 Toys Collared and Reprogrammed Body Carb. That's right, carb. <laughs> Uh, I just got this guy out of the box recently. I, I think it's actually like a year old or so. Um, I could be wrong about that. It might be less than that, but man, it's pushing it if not. Um, but yeah, I've been opening up a lot of stuff lately, so this is one of the figures, and I thought I'd give it a nice quick review. If you don't know what this is, this is basically the synthetic human body, which is something they've been doing. You know, uh, done here in black with like some extra features. There's a bunch of figures that they've been doing um, uh, like this, which is cool and easy. It's kind of like, and there's like art toy collaborations with them. Um, but, you know, this is their own deal. This is basically this reprogrammed. You know, if there's a story behind it, you know, that's what it is. This is the bad guy. The bad guy one. And it is really, really nice. It's it's a beautiful looking figure. As is Synthetic Human. I really dig this guy a lot. So, and probably an injustice. I'm just going to get into this one. That I didn't include this guy in my tops of last year because this definitely was up there. Um, I don't know how he didn't make it in there. I don't know if I forgot or what the deal is there, but hmm, not cool. Head sculpt is amazing. I really love it. I really love it's got like a translucent eye there, which looks really good. And then you have little, little, little like translucent little dots all over him. And I don't think it's painted. I think eh, maybe they're painted. I don't know. I saw like a shine on there that made it look translucent. But even if they're painted, they're done really well. I really like it. It's a really cool look. It kind of has like a like a hockey mask look to it as well. Um, but yeah, that it, that looks great. I really love this whole head sculpt. Very beautiful. Very nicely done. The neck looks awesome as well. It's got a lot of great detail in it. Check out the spine if you want to look at the spine all going down in this gunmetal gray. Beautifully done there. You got a lot of nice different shades of black and and um, grays and stuff. You got a lot of gunmetal gray going down here. Really nice looking. Beautiful. And then it's like, it's kind of a dark gray and less black. Uh, it's also a little bit pearlescent, which is good. And then you got a nice silver here going up this arm, which is all new stuff. Really nice. This is This is pretty much the regular arm from the synthetic human, but this is all brand new sculpt. Really cool looking. Like very awesome, very robotic, and he's got this really weird three-fingered hand here um, in a nice gnarly pose. Nicely sculpted, really well done, and there's a weapon gimmick. Now this guy doesn't have any extras, like any accessories at all. Uh, but his two accessories come with him. So he's got two blades there that pop out from there, a little slide lever. That looks pretty cool. And then we go to the other hand, and he's got this, like, middle finger blade, basically. I, I, I can't see what else it would be. It's a middle finger blade. Uh, and that swivels. So that's pretty awesome. The legs, uh, this leg is purely the synthetic human leg, but looking good in these colors. I really dig it a lot. And then the lower leg on this one is brand new, and it does match this aesthetic. I like the red going down. That's really beautiful. The silver they chose is excellent. And the foot sculpt, it's very cool, very like reminiscent of like a Terminator. Um, so pretty cool. I, I really, really dig the look of this guy. I have no idea why this guy did not come out of its case, but you know, again, it's kind of chalks it up to like I chalk it up to like just having so much already open and not reviewed. So it is what it is. This is how I roll here at Ultrazilla Toys, and you know what? 
can only do what I can do. I am not, <laughs> I, I am Ultrazilla and no one else, you know? You know what I'm saying, guys? I can't really, can't, I can't look at what everybody else is doing. I just could do what I can do. And that's it. Right? Right? <laughs> but this figure is awesome looking. Really awesome looking. And let's do articulation, which is uh, an amazing thing with these uh, synthetic humans. So head, you see it's on a ball joint up here. Really great. Double ball joint, you know, at the bottom and the top. Looks really good. Works really well. And then you got a neck joint there. Works really well as well. You got joint here floating piece with a bigger joint there so you get a lot of great range of motion there really good really um it's a little loose i mean it looks a lot loose but like it won't like hinder your posing or anything you know what i'm saying um the very free movement in the whole waist and chest area butterfly joint at the shoulder works well and then you got hinge swivel otherwise, works well as well. You do have a bicep swivel, the double jointed elbow, nice hinge swivel action at the wrist. The legs are on these balls here and you get really great range of motion in them. He could kick way high and way back. So you got a swivel in there just really works well. It's kind of like a butterfly joint for the thigh, and that is amazing. Amazing. Again, you got the swivel. You got double jointed knee, which even on here works really great. Superb there. Hinge, swivel here. Toe articulation on this side. Was there toe articulation on this side? No, there isn't. Um, but you got a lot of range of motion, guys. A ton. It is quite, quite fantastic. Great figure. Oh man, it doesn't need extra uh, accessories. It is perfect on its own. Um, let's do some size comparisons though. Again, here is the synthetic human. Here we have Kiryu, who I will be reviewing shortly. Recently reviewed Goku Black. He wants to uh, stand. He does want to stand, which is nice. We got Power of the Primes Deluxe Class Wreck Gar. What we got here? Laughing Prince Adam. He knows what's going on. And uh, PS4 Spidey, who also knows what's going on so there you go guys there's a bunch of different figures for you to size compare and that's it that is my review of the car but which is collared and reprogrammed body um but it just sounds funny as carb yeah he's, he's a carb <laughs> he's a good carb uh i i don't know what the availability on this is anymore honestly uh, but it is an amazing figure and if you could get your hands on it i highly recommend it as I do with the Synthetic Human. Such a great figure. All right, guys, and that's my review. Please like, comment, subscribe, and share if you have this. Let me know your thoughts on it. And until next time, peace out, peeps.